It's an incredible field that we have for this year's Maui Invitational. Five of the top 11 teams in the current Ken Palm ratings involved, as well as three of the top four teams in the AP poll. Syracuse and Tennessee get us started, followed by the main event for Monday, Gonzaga versus Purdue. Kansas gets the fortunate draw by getting to face tournament host Chaminade. But the game I want to focus in on, guys, is the nightcap, as number four Marquette faces a UCLA. Now, Ken Palm may not have Marquette rated as highly as the AP poll, but the Golden Eagles are one of only nine teams in the country right now that ranks in both the top 20 in offensive efficiency and defensive efficiency. They're eighth offensively, 19th defensively for those who are interested. Marquette, 3-0 start. Everything's going well, and they are off a nice win last Tuesday in Champaign-Urbana over Illinois Despite being the number four ranked team in the country, they were two-point underdogs in that contest. They win 70-64, to and although he was questionable due to an ankle injury, reigning Big East Player of the Year, Tyler Kolek, he showed up in a major way. 24 points on 10 of 18 shooting to go along with six rebounds and four assists. Kolek and Cam Jones, who's the team's leading scorer, by the way, at 19.3 points per game, form one of the best backcourts in the entire country. That is certainly something you want to keep in mind when handicapping Marquette. And again, I want to go back to the fact this team was an underdog at Illinois. It shows, again, it's not easy to win in Champaign-Urbana. Uh, the odds makers know that. I know that. You know that. But Marquette, you got to give them credit. They ended Illinois' eight-game win streak at home, and the Illini had also previously beaten 10 straight non-conference opponents at home so again that is a quality win certainly a more impressive win than anything on the resume of UCLA also 3-0 like Marquette but the Bruins three wins have come against St. Francis PA Lafayette and Long Island Bruins did not cover in the last two games uh, though it should be noted they were favored by 25 and 35 points respectively in those Tonight is going to mark UCLA's first time leaving campus this season. I think that's important to note. And considering the fact that they turned it over 14 times against Long Island last Wednesday, I'd be a little concerned with this matchup against Marquette. A couple of other issues I have with the Bruins. Four of last year's five starters are gone, and they're only shooting 24% from three thus far. An average of only two makes per game from behind the arc. Not sure how they can keep up with the top 10 team in offensive efficiency when you're shooting the three that poorly. The last game against Long Island, 0 for 6 were the Bruins from behind the arc. So my recommendation here is going to be to lay the points with Marquette. Too much experience, too much scoring for UCLA to keep up. I would play this up to 7. Uh, there's some 5.5s and, and 6s out there as we're recording. Now another recommendation I have is to head on over to the wagertalk.com uh, website right now where we have our once a year 70 or 69 dollar seven day all access special going on once again it's our annual special 69 dollars seven day all access for feast week a seven day all access gets you every play from your favorite handicapper in every sport including one of the best weeks of football betting of course we've got a full slate of three games on Thanksgiving in the NFL, the Egg Bowl, Mississippi, Mississippi State there, College Football Friday, College Football Saturday, NFL Sunday. And not only do you get seven days worth of picks for less than $10 a day, but you get the plays as soon as they're released. So very convenient. If you're traveling during the holiday, you can lock in the best lines as well. Again, it, this happens just once a year. $69 for seven days, all access, do not miss out. And I'd like to point out, I am coming off a 4-0 Sunday sweep in the NFL. Now on a 20-9 all-sports run over the last six days. Go back a little bit further. I've now posted a winning record nine of the last 10 days overall. So head on over to my page right now, wt.buzz backslash bp, to take advantage of that seven-day special. And if you're looking for more great previews, click on this next video.